Yo, y'all already know I got another build video for y'all. All right, it's the NBA 2K21 Next Gen, man. For all my Next Gen people out there, bro, listen. 2K22 is on the way, so do not worry. All right, we will be saved soon because they better come with it. I'm not playing with 2K, you feel what I'm saying? But this is the Damian Lillard build, scoring machine build, one of the best scoring machine builds in the game, bro, easily. Um, this is a guard build. All right, I gotta, I'm gonna have a big man build coming soon, probably like a power forward. You know what I'm saying? Like a little stretch or something. I don't know, but yeah, just just copy all these physicals I got right there. You know what I'm saying? I ain't changed too much, but six three is a good height for this game, just for guards. You know what I'm saying? Cause it's not too short, but you still gonna be super fast. You feel me? And you still gonna be able to dunk and all that, get your posterized and all that. You feel me? But right here, as you can see, I put the shooting up. I didn't end up with 30 shooting badges. I just started it out right there. Cause this is you know a mainly scoring build so i want to start out with the scoring aspects first and then try to finesse you know finesse the badges at the end or whatever but um you know that's that's just how i like to do my builds where i start out with what i really want first max it out and then take away a little you know little by little as i go on with it, you feel what i'm saying but as you can see you do not need strength all right strength is irrelevant you know what i'm saying i don't think no guard build even touches their strength like why would you even touch your strength bro you feel what i'm saying but with this build it's going to be basically playmaking and shooting as you can see i'm trying to you know finesse the badges right here you feel what i'm saying but this build go crazy because it's the it's the main build that i use for you know my actual uh game plays and all that i don't know if it's the exact same because the, i got less badges on my real player but like it's pretty much the same concept you feel what i'm saying when playmaking went shooting and then we put the still up all right and this game defense does not matter so you really don't it's really no point in even upgrading your perimeter defense when you make a build it don't matter if you're a power forward or guard like defense just don't matter in this game and it's sad but it's true and because it don't matter what you want to do is you want to put the still all the way up you know what i'm saying instead of trying to worry about you know uh all the perimeters and you know all the interior defense like even if you're a big man none of that like none of those stats matter you feel what i'm saying so just put your still up so you can get the pickpocket so you can get interceptor and all that and you'll be gucci bro you do not need perimeter defense bro no bill now right here i was basically trying to finesse some of the badges so i can get more finishing badges for y'all i know a lot of y'all like dunking and all that so i definitely had to get a little bit more there's not really a slasher, so like you're not going to go too crazy on the finishing badges. But well, I still, we still have to get a couple in there, you know what I'm saying, for the guys that like to go to the cup. So as you can see, we here on the takeover screen, man. I wanted to go with Limitless because, like, you know, that's what Dame do, you know what I'm saying? If you go with Limitless, you got to go ankle breaking shots right after that, you know what I'm saying? That's like, once you get double take, it's just unguardable, bro, you know what I'm saying? Because you want to break their angles, you can drive by them. And you're going to be limitless as soon as you pull up from half, you feel me? But as you can see, we got Shades of Baron Davis, Damian Lillard. I don't know. I don't really know why I said De'Aaron Fox because, like, De'Aaron got way more slashing than shooting. But, you know, 2K, 2K broke. So, you know what I'm saying? That's that's how, that's how that's 2K logic for you, you feel me? But we about to go over these badges. All right. You only get four finishing with this build. If you want more, you can just take some of the shooting and put a little bit more if you want it. But the way i do it is i would either go all the way posterizer hall of fame or go half and half with posterizer and slithery finisher all right so silver and silver both both combinations is good i like that combination better though because they kind of patch they kind of patch posterizers you feel what i'm saying but with the shooting deep threes hall of fame you need that hot zone hunter you need that i don't hear more i don't hear enough people talking about hot zone hunter and catch and shoot is just an obvious like given you feel me? If you're a primary dribbler, you can put it down to like go to silver. I'm a primary ball handler, but I still got a Hall of Fame with my real build. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm not really, I'm not really worried about all that, but you need green machine. Blonders, you don't really need, but if you want it, get it Hall of Fame. Like you either have it or you don't, you feel me? And hot shot, you want hot shot on gold. All right. I, I put my hot shot on gold. 
you can put it on silver it's just hot shot just help you get your take over so we'll definitely put that on with this one all right playmaking you definitely need quick first step that's self-explanatory you need bullet passer or if you want to actually pass the ball if you're not a passer then just put it on bronze or just don't you don't use it but if you are overall player then put it on at least silver you also need hall of fame um handles for days that's important especially on 2v2 if you play 2v2 a lot i put the dimer just on just because you know what i'm saying put it on bronze real quick tight handles pretty much goes with ankle breakers so you know those, those go hand in hand and as far as the defensive badges, we got 10 upgrades. That's pretty good, especially for a scoring machine build. So what we're going to do is put four of them on pickpocket. Why not? And then put the other four in the scepter and then put rebound chaser on silver. Rebound chaser this year, you need that badge because for some reason, they don't catch the ball, bro. But that's that's the build. That's it right there, bro. That's the scoring machine. Damian, love the build, man. Let me know if it worked for y'all. Let me know what builds y'all want to see me make next. And that's it, bro. I'm out, bro. You got to like the video. You got to sub. You got to comment. You got to do all that. You got to follow my IG, Twitter, all that. You got to do all that, bro. Okay.